Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Crusader Kings 2. I am Thousand Daggers and last we left off, uh, it was before PAX. And now it is after PAX. And I don't remember a thing of what I was doing. Uh, I do know one thing, my heir is still, uh, my daughter. And I don't have a son, for some odd reason. She's not even pregnant, and she's 24. I'm 29. I don't get it. Why are we having trouble having kids? Is it me? No. Let's have, is it because I'm away from uh, home? It shouldn't be. Well, that might suffer a penalty. But we should still have kids. I've got have a son. That should give us more more points. Um. Hmm. Well then. Oh, that's right. I took this county from that one dude who doesn't matter anymore. So we have a lot more troops, or at least we should, right? We have 3.23, okay. Mm, we have a lot of troops. Is there an easy way to tell how many troops I'm actually giving him? Like, uh... Uh, ooh, hold on. Opinion of liege. We've got two children here. Two dukes of that are children over here. We need this guy to die. Can we kill him? We can't. Um, these children. Who? What? Are, who are we? What's? Our, we're Diaco of ha de Castile. I just want to see if we can inherit anything. I don't know if we have a relationship with these people that would cause us to have that. Okay. Never mind. Um. Let's see. We might have to try to become friends with these people. Uh. Him being ambitious is good. Because he'll want... Galicia. Did you form Galicia? You did. He, when he becomes of age, he's 15, so next year, roughly, he'll want this kingdom from the king. So we might be able to force him into a faction, which will be good, or he might join a faction even. Uh, we, can, we cannot start a faction right now, still. Uh, so we're kind of at a loss as to what to do. We could attack into the... Umiads, but that sounds like a bad plan. Uh, yeah, it sounds like a bad plan. Especially since we can't call in any of our allies. Oh, he's a child now. No! You have significantly less troops now, don't you? Damn it! Ugh. You're lucky you have... Oh, you don't have that alliance anymore! Heh, heh, heh. Ah, ha, ah, ha. I might, I might have to, I might, this might have to happen. We will have to see. Uh, let's see, he's got 899, we're at 777, okay. What's our tech at right now? Uh, we could spend some points. I haven't even made the, uh, the clock. Let's get construction, that's always good. Um, looking at tolerance or noble, let's get noble customs, that's good. All right, let's get speed going. We need to just get going. Militia training grounds? Oh, you're building something. Well, that's good. Oh, boy. Computer is not happy for some reason. It was not happy when I was uh, editing earlier. We have one vassal. We're at a our domain limit, though. What's our stewardship? Eh, it's decent. It's not bad, but it's not that great. Plus, we're in Gavelkin, which he's giving an extra one. Honestly, if I was going to have... I'd probably give this up to someone, to be honest. I'd keep these three, and then give that to someone. If I was king, I could probably have four, which means I could just have this entire duchy and give all the rest of the land to, to other people. Uh, we're still fabricating claim on that. How much does this guy like us? He loves us. We're the best. 
He's trying to have a daughter. We're trying to have a son. I wish I had your problem. Jeez. <laughs> uh, still no faction. We can plot to kill people. Ooh, this is our cousin? She is... The spy master of Galicia. Why? Which is your relationship? You're her. You're my cousin. Is your mother? Hmm. Hmm. Could we inherit? Can't kill him yet. Hmm. I don't think so. Let's see, who is who is the heir to the throne here? Olio Olitokti Coimbra. Ah. Okay. Uh no, no arbitrary. Lose arbitrary. Bad arbitrary. Be just like me. Oh, I'm not just. Never mind. Don't be like me. Be better than me. Um, my liege expelled the Jews because he's an idiot. Jews are good. Don't do that. It's dumb. Well, it's actually great, but I mean, borrow money first, then expel Jews. And I didn't borrow any money, so it's bad. Uh... If I could create my own realm, if I became independent, I could probably invite the Jews back in. Hmm. What's lo how's it looking over here? Not good. Pope does not like me very much, but we've already got our chancellor in it. Ooh. Use it. Use it. Use it. All right. Navara, who are your allies? <laughs> this dude. All right, then. Uh, that's actually not small or insignificant. However, you will have to get over here, which means that gives me a chance to beat his army before you show up. Really? Most of it's his troops? He only has 98 from vassals. How many boats do you have? Let's see. So you have 2,000 troops, but you have 13 boats, which means you can only carry 1,300 troops at a time. Yeah. I see no reason not to go after this claim that I just made for myself. Uh. Yeah. I want that. That's mine now. Uh, we are going to... We're going to improve relations with the Duke of Por Portugale, because uh, I think that's how you... I don't think it's pronounced Portugal. It might be pronounced Portugal. But I'm pretty sure it's pronounced Portugale. Um, anyways, we're going to we're gonna go out... We're basically going to try to ally... Oh, he's already of age. Oh, he's already... Oh, we can't start a faction. Okay. Uh, declare war, claim Navarra. Yes, I want it. Oh, but that will raise... Mm. Oh, hold on. Why Why is this a thing? Should we wait? Let's wait a little bit. We should gain a lot of troops. Fat. We should gain troops fast because we, uh... We have, uh... What's the word I'm looking for? We have, um things. We have our marshal there training troops, so it should grow pretty pretty fast. It's already grown a little bit. He should not be growing at all, because it looks like he's capped. Yeah. We need to kill his troops. That's just basically what needs to happen. Uh, let's pause the game and look at this. Okay, if we bring these out, we are losing eight. So we're going to be spending about 1.8 gold a month. Or 1.75 gold a month on uh, troops during this war. So we can have the war go continue for like 24 months or something like that. Um, so not like two years. We have two years to take this this entire thing. 
Um, I don't. I don't think that'll be a big issue, actually. Um, in fact, I'm thinking of just doing it right now because we can. Just to clear, uh, we've got the troops. I'm not too worried. We want your lands. We're gonna. We're gonna bring out everything. Uh, we're gonna send our troops that way. Let's see. He's probably gonna raise his troops. He's gonna march on those guys. When do these guys show up? October 25th. Mine will show up October 24th, October 19th. I think we'll get there before he does. Uh, how many troops is this? 2,300? We should win. Yeah, he's backed off already. Now he's heading to Najera. And he'll be there in a second. These guys are already... Well, we got some troops from Burgos. Or, um... Yeah, these troops will take a little while to get there. But we won't, hmm. Yeah, we're going to gather here instead. We're going to get these troops laid out. Get them started. Okay. He might have better generals. I don't have that great of generals. Let's, in fact, let's uh, check right now. See if there's any better generals that we can have. See, this guy's pretty crap. Uh, that guy's pretty good. We'll grab him. Uh, that guy is pretty good. We'll grab him. And that's a steward. We'll just we'll just go with those guys. Okay, so we have this guy who's still our number one uh, just because of his martial score. I guess he does not that great. Let's see. Um, this guy, however, gets morale damage. Let's put him in front, in the middle. Then this guy on the side. And, oh, narrow flank is really good. But the morale defense is meh. But the narrow flank is really good. The personal combat's good. I think we'll stick with the Mario Burgos. Although we don't get narrow flank if we're attacking. Now I think about it. I think I think it's only if you're defending. So wait for these guys to get in here, and then we'll attack him. He should have called in these guys. They're they're not. Ooh. They're helping Brittany in a war. Uh, <laughs> well then, this war will be easy. I was having to expect that I was gonna have to fight Powis as well, but I guess not. Uh, strange how the. Hmm. Apparently, I didn't get anything for that. That's weird. Maybe it's because I'm uh, cynical. That'd be pretty terrible if that was the reason. All right, let's go. Uh, let's see. The uh, supply here is... <laughs> we don't have enough troops to worry about supply yet. Um, yeah, vassals raised. That's fine. We want Navara. It is ours. <laughs> I'm going to be very angry if our king creates the kingdom of Navarra. I'll be really pissed. Uh, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Oh, hold on. So he likes us. Does he have a faction? Nope. Heck, if he had a faction where he's like, I want the kingdom of Galicia, I'd totally help him. Uh, so what we got here? January 4th, January 9th. Oh, we've got him now. Is this a river crossing? Yeah, it is, but we can take it. We've got the numbers advantage. We've already routed hit that side. He had eight troops there. And we're still... As we're doing this, we're in the capital training troops. Look at this. We're expanding. We're fighting the king who has a martial score of... Oh, you injured... Oh, wait. No, that was our lower guy. But he's really good because he's got... He does a lot more damage. We've got him flanked. Oh, look at that. 320. Oh, we killed him. We killed them all. Let's go. We can't build any retinue. We're done. We're done. We don't have any retinue to build. We want Navara. Give it to us. Uh, we can't, we can't uh, assault it. We'll just wait. We'll just sit on the castle and wait. And we should only have to take the castle, I think. We've got enough war score. Improved relations with the Pope. Uh, let's... 
get that guy back here uh, to improve relations with the bishop uh, in Burgos. I feel pretty confident with my relationship with the Pope now. I feel better about it, I should say. Uh, can this guy win? No, not even close. You can play this little game, but usually I'm not. I don't bother um, unless I'm uh, unless I'm a big nation. Really, that's really the only time I bother. Uh, because the bigger your nation, the more car or the more bishops you have. The more bishops you have, the more chances that you have a good bishop to become a cardinal. So the so really you only play that game if you're a big nation like France or. If you're an empire-sized nation, you have multiple kingdoms, uh, it's worth doing. Oh, Typhus is here. That's no good. This guy, <laughs> he's about to lose his kingdom. He, the, the Basque, the Basque are about to become no more. They're they're about to just be a conquered people. <laughs> as is as is historical. Like I said, we're losing money, but not much actually. Uh, we did lose some troops, so uh, yeah, we're not losing too much. I can't remember what the pe the levy uh, reinforcement penalty is when you have your troops out, but I wonder if it's being uh, if the penalty is being reduced. Well, it's being reduced, but I wonder if it's getting negated by the fact that I have this and my my uh, marshal, who's actually not that great of a marshal. I wish I had a better one. I mean, 13's okay, but I, I like it when all these guys have, like, over 15. Like, and so my marshal and my spymaster, I feel like, are kind of meh. Uh, I wonder if there's a better... Nah, not really. That's about as good as it's going to get. Actually, if my marshal has good... Combat modifiers. He's got okay mod combat. He's a wait a peasant leader. What? What's this? Peasant leader. This character is a jumped up peasant who revolted against his betters, and I took him on. That's hilarious. He's just sitting in my in my. <laughs> That's hilarious. I love it. That's great. He's depressed because he he's, he just sucks. He's got no piety because he's lustful. He likes to sleep around a lot. Probably has uh, some uh, lovers. He doesn't. He sucks. All right. Do we want her to become envious or do we want her to be kind? We want her to be kind, mostly. Damn it. Envious isn't bad, though. I should have kept it. And then hope for, like, other modifiers. Oh, we can get one of these. Okay, what should we get? Uh, I'm looking at shipbuilding. Yep. And town infrastructure? That would help us raise income for the mayors, which would increase our taxes. That's not bad. Majesty, I think, is better than tolerance right now. We have a bunch of... Well, Basque. We'd have Basque culture. But uh, this is about to become a... Vista Gothic uh, dude in a second. We're about to put someone in charge of Navarra, and he's not Basque. He's going to be our culture group, and we might... No, that doesn't work. Unless we, can, well, unless we have a son pretty soon. My god, where is those children? Oh, she's a bastard? I didn't realize she was a bastard. I thought she was a twin. I thought that's what it was. Oh, well. She's depressed. Oh, that's no, that's no good. Don't be depressed. Mm. Oh, yes! Okay, good. We have a child. It better be a boy. <laughs> God damn it. I wanted to be a boy so bad. Uh, if we have a... See, the issue with having two duchies is... Uh, if we have two duchies, then uh, it gets split up between... Because we have Gavalkins. However, having two duchies, we could become independent and then make a kingdom. Okay, we got this. Oh, someone else is taking this. You have no nothing now. All right, let's do this. 
We got we got to take care of the fact that we're over uh, our domain limit. Uh, let's see. We want to find someone who's a man who's not in prison. Don't care if they're married. Who's not a ruler? Who is of my religion, my culture? Is an adult. Search my court. Oh, these are all heirs to the bishopric. Show realm. And we're looking for someone with some good, uh, he's probably not going to join me. Probably not going to join me. We're looking at the realm right now. So we're looking for someone who is in our courts or in our, uh, I don't think we're going to find anyone to be honest. This guy? Invite to court. No, he's got a lot of reasons not to. Hmm, this is going to be tough. He might join us. He doesn't like his, uh... Oh, if we could pay him off. Pay him 20 gold to come into our court. Uh, there's not really a good reason to, though. He kind of sucks. Um, <laughs> let's just look for someone else. My cousin. He won't join us. I'm looking for people who aren't heirs to anything, is what I'm doing. He's a good chancellor. He does like us more than his current liege. However, yeah, no reason to move because he's a chancellor. So we're probably not going to grab any of these people. And these people suck. Oh, man. Let's look for people who like us a lot and just pick people that have some high stat. We're not going to be picky right now. Marshal, Marshal, Chancellor, Marshal, Commander. You might move. Who's your liege? You invite to court. You won't leave. Because you're a commander. This guy sucks, but we're going to bring him aboard. Because he will. Ah, uh, this sucks. Alright, you. Invite to court. Yes, come here. So we'll wait a little while. We'll let some time go by. He'll come into our court. He's not going to become steward. <laughs> That's for sure. All right, he's here. You get to be, um, you get to be the Count of Navarra. Congratulations. Don't die. I know you're 50, but don't die. I need you to run things. <laughs> People probably really hate him. Let's see. This guy, yeah, really hates him. Really hates him. And really hates him. Well, you know, he's not supposed to, uh... He's just supposed to do his job. He's cynical. He's craven. He's arbitrary. I put the worst guy in charge. He's greedy. But he's, a, he's fun to talk to. We have good discussions about how God doesn't exist. That's what we do. <laughs> And that's why he's in charge, because I go, you know what? I remember that one dude. He's like 50. I had a good conversation with him. Let's put him in charge of Navarra. He has, like, no skills whatsoever in actually running running any kind of castle or county. But you know what? Put him in charge. <laughs> well, that will be it for that episode. So if you enjoyed the episode, please remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you all next time. <laughs>